to part one of iVision overview. Today I'm going to show you how to take a delivery. So let's say for example a customer is phoning in. His number should appear at the top of the screen. And as you can see the number here is flashing customer phone number and we would go to delivery. We would ask him for his postcode so let's say for example he said M160AD then we'd go to postcode search. Choose the number, it's 39 College Drive and you can, if you want, save his information. You can ask him for his title, so it can be Mr. Khan, for example. And you can save it. Remember, this is optional. So moving on, we go to OK. And now we're going to take the delivery. So as an example, we want, say, Mexican pizza, 14 inch. And as you can see, it's listed at the top right corner here. Let's say, for example, he wants two more burgers, two more chicken burgers. The should to be quarter pounders. And I'm just going to show you a quick uh, feature here. You can choose that everything is on, so all the types of dressings, salt, mayo, with the exception of by going to no thanks to vinegar and onion, for example. And you can see here that it said plus everything on and no to vinegar and onion. So we're going to go to drinks. He wants say Vinto can. And let's say, for example, he decided not, no, he wants a Pepsi. We make sure this is highlighted and we go to the scissors here which deletes the entry then we go to Pepsi can if he wants two or three cans of Pepsi you make sure that's highlighted once more and you can increase the quantity or decrease the quantity so we can increase the quantity to three by going to the plus sign here I'm going to show you one more thing which is the discounts option you can see three buttons here on the right you've got half price which is 50% off discount percentage which I'll be talking about that later or if you want to give something for free. Now let me show you the discount percentage. You can see here that you have a percentage and a value. You can select to discount a certain percentage of your choice or you can set a value that you want to give a discount for. So I can for example set £2.50 off and then I can choose the reason why I've put off £2.50. Let's say for example it was a special offer. And then I can select whether the discount offer would be on the current line of the can of Pepsi for example or on the whole order total. I'm going to select on the order total. Now I'm going to go to finish and as you can see it has given me choices of how long the delivery would take. This would come in handy as when the receipt comes out you will see how long it will take. So let's say for example it's going to take 25 minutes to get there and as you can see it's 11.43 now its estimated delivery time will be 12, 8 minutes. So now I'm going to go to print and the receipt comes out very quickly. So let's analyze what's in the receipt. Firstly you have the address of the takeaway with the information of the customer if you decided to record his information and obviously his address and these are the list of items that the customer has ordered and it gives you here the change that it's estimated and also the date and time and the delivery time as well as how it was paid for cash or over the internet I'm going to show you how to take an order from a customer who's in the shop so we're going to go to takeaway and we're going to choose what this customer wants so for example he wants a veggie burger half a pounder as I've showed you previously, you can choose that he wants everything on with the exception of jalapenos and mayo. Okay, so now I'm going to show you how to take an order from a customer who's inside the shop. So he wants a takeaway. We can choose, for example, that he wants a pizza, a Mexican pizza, 14 inch, and you can choose to put on extra toppings. We can choose, for example, that he wants jalapenos on the whole pizza. And if, for example, he's sharing the pizza, he can choose that in the first half of the pizza, he can have garlic butter in it, and in the second half, he can have sweet corn on it. This is a really, really good feature. So moving on, let's say the customer wants kebabs also. We can choose a shish donut kebab with pita bread. We can choose the dressings or the uh, sauces. Let's say, for example, he wants salad and chili sauce. Now we can go to extras and choose, for example, onion rings. These onion rings, for example, we can set them to be free if it was on an offer. So make sure this is highlighted and we just press on free here and it's discounted it from the whole list. But let's say, for example, we want this to be half price and not free. We'll choose it again. I've removed it by clicking on the scissors. Onion rings, make sure it's highlighted and we can just press on half price. 
this halved it from 1.20 to 60 pence. Okay, so now I'm going to click on finish. Okay, so the total sale is £16.90. Let's say that the customer paid £20. It calculated the change here automatically being £3.10. If we look at the bottom right corner here, you can see the amount of time we expect the takeaway to be ready. So let's we can just set it to be 15 minutes and it should be ready. Okay, so now I'm going to be clicking on print, one receipt. And as you can see, the cash draw comes out so you can put the money in. And here is the receipt like I've showed you previously. Thank you very much for watching part one of iVision Overview.